Hey everybody, my name is Sarah Lean and I'm a Senior Cloud Advocate at Microsoft. In previous videos I've went through what the Windows Admin Centre is capable of but today I want to show you how you can actually RDP or Remote Desktop into other servers using Windows Admin Centre. So let's have a look. <music> Admin Center landing page and we can see that I'm managing a few servers already. Now I want to interact with this server that lives in Azure so I connect to it and once it launches we get a menu system with lots of options. Now the one that we are concerned with today is remote desktop so we scroll down until we get to that option. Windows Admin Center will start to connect with the server and start to open up that remote desktop connection. We get a few prompts about certificate that we want to connect to and we're also asked for our credentials again. So we input the credentials that we can use to RDP into the server. After a few minutes, what will happen is within the Windows Admin Center console, we will get our remote desktop session and we can interact with the server. And it's just like interacting with any other server if you were to remote desktop into it or if you were sitting in front of that server. We can just manage it like normal. Now, I'm using a virtual machine that lives in Azure to do this, but obviously you can use it to um, connect to any server that has um, interactions with your Windows Admin Center console. If you want to know more about Windows Admin Center or to download it to start using it as a management tool within your environment, please do check out the link on screen today and we'll also share it in the description of this video. Thank you for tuning in.